Right, small video. It's the 20th of January 2020. So it's 20, 20, 20 today. It's not often you get that. 20, 20, 20. I'm up, I've just climbed up through the wood from Cheddar to the, this side of the the north side of the gorge. Lots of goats sunbathing, foraging, a few people out walking. I've put far too many clothes on, but I've got the waterproofs on for a reason, as mudproofs, because as the sun is out, it's going to melt all the well, sort of frozen mud. And I'm already getting muddy anyway, so, but it is a bit too hot to have them on. But it will get cold later. It was cold when I first arrived, very cold. I had hat, scarf, gloves. Since then, I've taken the hat, scarf and gloves off. And I've also taken off my big woolly jumper, because I really don't need it. It is really, really hot with that on. I'll need it later. So there's the gorge down there, some beautiful misty views of um, Nyland Mound, Glastonbury Tor, Brent Knoll, all the usual reference points are sticking out well. But as you can see it is a bit muddy here. Now I could have gone the other way, which was it would have been the exact reverse of what I'd done the other week. Um, but I thought no. There's some, I like to sometimes do this way. Usually I do it when it's the season of the cow. I mean, normally I take advantage of those fields being empty up there. But it is very, very boggy. I mean, I don't know what it's going to be like here along here in a minute. Um, there's a couple, two couples ahead of me. Um, taking their time. I don't think they've been here before, so they... You can go whichever way you want, really. So I'm just doing a small video. I've had a little bit of cheese. I've had my topic chocolate bar. I'm slower than I usually am because um, it was quite... I was quite hot and I've been a bit more breathless today. Um, but I'm all right now. I'm just taking my time. I don't want to slip in this. I don't want to slip in it. I'll go for it higher up, I think. Yeah, so I was just I don't really want to be right on top of other people, so I'm giving them a bit of a head start. But the, when you're new to a place, you can sometimes be very slow. But today it's best to take care. So I'm just videoing this side. The other week I'd went over the other side along and around and up by Longwood, not through it, bypassing Longwood and then Piney Slights. Um, I can't remember what date that was when I'd done all that. But I like to get the reverse in before the season of the cow. Um, when I say the reverse, that means right up over there. I saw a hot air balloon. Last time I was here, it was a hot air balloon. Came over from Thatcher's. And, um... And I saw the alapacas. It's funny, people hold hands when they're walking along here. I think you'd be a lot safer if you didn't do that. Um, I know it's nice um, to feel that, but who's to say that person holding you around ain't going to slip? You'll be dragged with them. Uh, it's not really a romantic walk as such. Yeah, some people ahead of me. I'm deliberately giving them a start. 
I mean, I could easily nip over here now and go across the fields. But I want to go up these steps. Don't know why I want to punish myself with them, though. I don't know why I don't want to do that. But I am going to. See, there's Nyland Mount, that, which I climbed last year in the autumn. Got off the bus at Draycott. Was it Draycott or the other place? And then uh, walked to an island, walked back, and then walked back to Cheddar along this lovely little country lane, which was very picturesque. It's very slippery here indeed. don't really know what, but uh, I think you should carry on up on the grass, you know. That's it. Carry on on the grass. <sighs> yeah, I don't know how bad it's going to be going down where the steps are. It probably would have been easier going that way. But all I know, it's like a quagmire over that way. There, they've moved on quite quickly now. Look, I can't see them now. Yeah, just over there, there's all the fields over to Piney Slights in there. And if this weather carried on, say, now, they might put the animals back out. To be quite honest, because it's so mild, the grass is growing. But, of course, you've got those frosts in the morning. All the little lambs are being born soon. Of course, the other thing is, I, um... I don't know what I was going to say now. It'd be a bit jumpy, this. I'm going to turn off now. Another small video. I'm on the other side, on the north side of uh, Cheddar Gorge. Um, it's quite dark because there's no sun on it at the moment from this side. This side would be all bright if you look, if you were over there. I decided to come this route along the gorge edge on this north side because I'm going to be going to Black Rock. And from Black Rock, I'm going to uh, climb up into the wood over there. Um, I, kn I was going to go across the top there, but I decided, no, try a different route. You don't have to do it completely in reverse. Um, we've now got a very sticky bit to do, which is going down the steps. Um, it is quite slippery. As uh, frost has melted, the water is starting to... Um, and I am getting muddy. So I am glad I've got these on, even though it's quite warm with them on. I'm glad I've got them on. But you don't want to fall here, you fall in it a stone. God, wouldn't that break your bloody spine? And I have got a habit of slipping, so I've got to be very careful. Just take my time. There's some two people, two couples ahead. One very young, fit couple, so I expect they disappeared ages ago. Um... Another couple could be my age. They're just the blokes helping the woman. Um, like you do in a chivalrous man, you know, don't think. No, but no, obviously some pe women, they've, we've all been brainwashed. You know, some people have. Um, so they don't think they can do anything on their own. See, a lot of women, they were brought up to be dependent. You know, she'll see women out on their own, and that's why some folks don't like it. They don't like seeing women on their own. They think they see us as a threat, for some reason. We're only a human being, just doing our own thing. And there's a lot of blokes that think it's great, so... And there's a lot of women who exactly the same, so it's not really a sexist thing. It's just a cultural thing. And we don't want to be going backwards with the 1959 lot. They want to get, get take us back to being tied to the kitchen again, for Christ's sake. Oh, they realise how symbolic that is. Oh. 
It's all about power and control. <sighs> I'm just videoing a bit of this so that you can see the terrain I'm facing. I don't want to slip, but it is very slippery. So I'm taking my time. Got to. <sighs> like I said, one slip onto one of these boulders, you really, really hurt yourself. It's not like when I was on the Quantox the other day, I slipped and fell on moss. <sighs> the tricky bit's coming in a minute, but it might not be tricky if it's the steps. It depends if the steps are slippery. Over and out, someone's coming. 